is going on YouTube it's your boy Billy Kibaki guys and today guys I'll be teaching you how you can play PSP games on your jailbroken PS3 guys so guys this only requires three applications to run the games and also my PlayStation firmware is rebug 4.81.2 guys so let's go ahead and jump right into this tutorial guys so let's go over to where my files are guys and you will need this the PSP launcher I will leave a link in the description so you guys can go ahead and get this to download so go ahead and extract it when you're done you're gonna get this folder so go, go inside and go inside this one as well you're gonna have these two um, PKG files so we need to copy both of them to the external hard drive or your USB stick so just in case one of these doesn't load the game guys you can use the other one to load it so let's go now guys and on your your portable hard drive just create a new folder and let's call that one PSP ISO all caps now let's go and grab ourselves a PSP game so I'll load I'll copy over a PSP game so I'll be using this one And let's paste it inside the PSP ISO folder. Okay, now that's done guys, you can go ahead and eject your your portable hard drive or USB stick. Now give me a second guys, let me plug this in the PlayStation. Now let's bring up our PlayStation guys. Okay, so now we're on the PlayStation guys so let's go over to your package manager go down to install and go down to standard now you're gonna install both of these PKG as I said you can only install one but install both of them because if one doesn't work you can use the other one and try and launch the game from that one so go ahead and install whichever one you want to use or you can install both so I'll be using this one guys so go down to your multi man now let it load up guys so guys inside multi man go all the way over to your right side and you'll come to the section where it says retro and just scroll down once the once the page is done refreshing just scroll down and you'll see your game that you just added to your external hard drive in the PSP ISO folder so this is the the, the game that I just transferred over and as you see guys it says USB right here so that shows that it's on my my external hard drive so go ahead and hit X it's gonna take you back out of Multiman guys so give it time until it boot again now scroll go up and you'll see that the icon that we just installed it changed to the game that you just um, loaded with Multiman so the PSP remaster launcher icon has just changed so press X on the game icon okay guys on this screen you need to select need to select the PSP remastered so select this one select this one the PSP 
and X. Now guys, let me mute my TV because I don't want any copyright to be in the video. That's it guys, so that's how you play PSP games on your PlayStation 3 guys. So guys, if this video was ever helpful to you guys or in any way, please leave a like, a subscribe and also share this video guys. Thanks for watching guys and see you in my next video. Okay, very important message guys. So not all PSP games will work when you're on Reebok 4.81 or Reebok 4.82 or Firefox 4.82. The best firmware that I've found that works with 95% um, of PSP games is Dartnet 4.66. Um, Cobra edition version 1.02. So guys this firmware if you're not um, um, too, too worried about going online and playing using cheats and all that and you just want to play some good games Good old-time games. I would recommend getting the Dartnet 4.66 Cobra edition because this one works with majority 95% um, of PSP games guys and it also works with PS1 and PS2 games guys So keep that in mind if you want to go get some some PSP games that you want to play Thank you.